Good morning, happy Tuesday. I'm at school. I am running a little bit late this morning. It is seven, like 7.21 or so. And since our copy machine is broke on our hallway, I have to go down to first grade hallway or upstairs to third and fourth grade hallway to make copies. So I'm gonna run and do that since I need some copies for math this afternoon. And I'll show you what I'm letting my kids do this morning for their morning tubs. So I have some Expo markers and erasers and whiteboards. I also have these search and finds. These are really fun. Um, I don't know where I got these, but I had a big book of them and I got them laminated. This one's coming off. But anyways, they find all of these things in the picture and circle it. And then those things at the top too. And then I just have this little pouch of the Visa V markers because they wipe off. You know what? I should probably use dry erase for this actually. And then I have some pattern blocks and paper so they can draw pattern blocks if they want. And then I just have these highlights, um, Puzzle Mania books. So those are their choices for this morning. But I'm gonna run and make some copies and I will probably be able to touch base with you guys during my planning today or actually lunch because that's first <laughs> I'll see you guys then y'all I'm getting another blister on my lip this job is killing me I'm telling you I think it's work it's just stressing me out because it's I'm trying to work a lot and I'm trying to do a lot and I'm trying to you know stay after school and tutor kids and make sure my plans are ready I'm working till five o'clock every night just Ugh, I don't know what else to do. But uh, my kids are at lunch and I'm hungry, so I'm gonna go get me some lunch as well. When they get back, we are going to decorate our Valentine's bags. So I've already put out their pink and red paper and then a little lunch bag. I'll show you the one that I made, it's really cute. So this is what they're gonna make. Just a little um, heart person with some arms and legs and some googly eyes and then write their name on it. So they're excited about that, but that's what we're gonna do when they get back and then we don't have specials today, excuse me, because all the students who got 95% or more on their class dojo for the month of January gets to go to a glow party today and that is during our specials time so my kids I have 13 kids going and I have six that aren't going. So those kids will stay in the room with me and work on things they need to finish while the other kids go to that glow party. And it's 45 minutes, I think. And then when they get back, we are gonna learn a new math game today. And since we have library and we don't get to go check out books because of the glow party, the librarian said that we could come at two o'clock this afternoon. So I'm gonna take my kids to exchange their books at the end of the day, which will be nice. So it's been a pretty good morning, just really busy. And I had four kids out yesterday and they all came in today with sick notes. So we're gonna have to make sure we wash our hands and try to keep from getting sick. So I'm gonna go eat some lunch and I'll see you guys in a little while. Cool. I love all the pink and red. I have no white on Why is it only pink and red? Do it on the inside, here. Why is it only pink and red? Ooh, nice, look at all that. I help Miss Edwards, can I do two different colors for the little things on the I did. Red. You need, what do you need? I didn't draw it for you? Keep it folded. Start right there and cut all the way around. Miss Edwards has it? Yep, just like that. This is confusing. You got four? I won. Come up. Okay. I'm coming. Bingo! I have 
And you have three. Uh huh. Hey, you're close. At least you have three. What if you didn't have zero? All right. So, take all of the chips off, put them in brand new places, and you can play again. No, those are mine. No, six. How many chips you got? What time are we? How many chips do you have? Two. How many do you have? Two. We're going out five in ten minutes when the big hand gets on the three. And since you're playing against each other, you'll have five change cards and you'll have five change cards. Is that 12? Well, I just got finished with my first tutoring session, which was not too bad. I was actually upstairs in a third grade classroom with another third, with another teacher who's a third grade teacher. And I had a group of six kids and we worked on multiplication. So we talked about factor and product and we used cubes to model and um, worked on some problems. So it went really well. It did go really quickly. like. I felt like we just sat down and then it was time to stop and we got all the kids on the bus and in the car and out the door and now I'm back in my room it is 4 10 and Paisley has gymnastics tonight so I'm gonna have to head out of here at about 4 30 um, I want to show you guys these super cute Valentine bags that my kids made today look how cute they are they're all so cute and so different and they really enjoyed making them. Um, I told them they could go ahead and bring in their Valentines and put them in there now. This afternoon we had library and then, well, we had library at two o'clock. We don't usually have anything at two o'clock but math. And so um, we stopped what we were doing and we went to the library and then we got back I read Froggy's first kiss to my class it's so cute if you have not read Froggy books you need to I have like probably 15 of them I just well maybe not 15 maybe like 10 maybe 12 I don't know but they're super cute and they're funny and the kids love them but what I was gonna say was look at this table so guess who gets to clean this up yeah and my counter's a mess. I feel like as soon as I get a mess cleaned up, there's another one. But I am going to stop rambling because I need to make sure I am ready for tomorrow. Because I just got back to my room and I have to leave in 20 minutes. And um, clean up this mess and lay my morning tubs out. I do have some papers I need to take home to grade. I'll probably do them during gymnastics. And so I'll catch up with y'all when I get ready to leave or when I get in the car. <laughs> Mommy, you have to take me out for dessert. I'll take you out for dessert. Yeah. We're in the car. I straightened up my room as quickly as I could. Sorry, my lens had some dust or something on it. And now we're headed to gymnastics. We need to get there a little early so Paisley can change. But I thought I would jump on here real quick and thank you so much for watching this video today. I hope that you enjoyed it. If you did, be sure to click on the thumbs up button down below this video to let me know you liked it. Remember to subscribe to my channel so you can see more videos from me. And don't forget to click on the notification bell so you get a notification every time I upload a video. So I'll take you out for dessert, so. Hi. Say bye.